Okay, I am Valky Alumutal and this is a presentation on completing the square. So we have this problem where 2x1 equals x5 squared minus 23, 4x squared minus x1 squared plus 7, and 6x3 equals x squared, x2 squared plus 14, and 8x4 equals x3 squared plus 23, and 10x5 equals x4 squared plus 34. So there are five equations. Solving it other ways, like with the system of equations, would be much harder because there are squares. So first, you should add all the equations. So 2x1 plus 4x2 plus 6x3 plus 8x4 plus 10x5 equals x1 squared plus x2 squared plus x3 squared plus x4 squared plus x5 squared plus 55. Then you move them all. So there's negative 55 equals x1 squared minus 2x1 plus x2 squared minus 4x2 plus x3 squared minus 6x3, plus x4 squared minus 8x4, plus x5 squared minus 10x5. You should complete the square. So you have squares here, negative 55 equals x1 squared minus 2x1 plus 1, minus 1, so this equals 0. And the same with all the other ones, x2 squared minus 4x2 plus 4, minus 4, x3 squared minus 6x3 plus 9, minus 9, x4 squared minus 8x4 plus 16 minus 16, x5 squared minus 10x5 plus 25 minus 25. So then you should turn them into squares. Negative 55 equals x1 minus 1 squared plus x2 minus 2 squared plus x3 minus 3 squared plus x4 minus 4 squared plus x5 minus 5 squared minus 55. So conveniently, it's all equal to 0 x1 minus 1 squared plus x2 minus 2 squared plus x3 minus 3 squared plus x4 minus 4 squared plus x5 minus 5 squared. So then for it all to be 0, then all squares are greater than or equal to 0 if the square is real. Since they're asking for real answers, these all have to equal 0 because none of them can be negative. So the, this has to be equal to 1. This has to be equal to 2, this has to be equal to 3, this has to be equal to 4, and this has to be equal to 5. So the solution is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. We check the answer by inputting it into these original equations and see if they work, and we find that they are correct.